Different platforms are today being used to lure congregation into Christ. And this man, Paulo Gallo, has a unique way of preaching the gospel. <laughs> In an attempt to lure more youth to attend the church mass, Father Paul Ogalo is a man of the cloth, using an uncommon preaching technique by rapping to the youth to accomplish his mission. Uh, my clip went viral unexpectedly. I didn't expect that, because usually what I'm doing, I've been doing it for the last one and a half decades since I was ordained in the year 2000. Ogalo, who grew up in Rapogi, says the mission dawned on him as an attribute of a disaster in 2007 at the carnival ground stampede, where he recalls a young Rapogi teenager die in the stampede. Ogalo since values youth empowerment and believes that practical living trends should be introduced to the youth as a way to improve their livelihood. Usually I do these things separately. Liturgy remains liturgy and then talks and entertainment uh, remain separate so that I attract young people to come to church and then I use that as bait to bring them to church and then we catechize them and make them productive citizens of the nation and members of the Catholic Church. That's my mission. The father commonly known as Sweet, which is an acronym to mean Paul sees the world in turmoil, is now encouraging churches to come up with programs which can make the youth appreciate God in their own practical way. So it is very fitting that we try to help young people to understand what life is and also to use art to evangelize the world. We have a lot of manpower. Our youth is so vibrant. We only need to uh, help them to nurture their potentials in them. Rapogi Parish youth leader Violet Menya says Ogalo's communication method has attracted a lot of youth since rap culture is appealing, even though he looks old but very young at heart. <laughs> Normally he brings uh, the youth close to the church and uh, he has a form of uh, after the mass and normally during the end of the mass he raps to the youth and his rapping does not actually base on the secular rapping but he, he, he inculcates the gospel and especially the ones of the reading like you know in the Catholic Church you have the readings so he will inculcate the readings into his rapping and this one I've seen it has brought the youth so much back to the church. During his Sunday ordination the father encouraged the youth to embrace the green revolution through tree planting and initiation of project which he believes will change family economies. As expected Paul has found himself rubbing shoulders with his seniors but believes that his way is the ultimate way to attract young people to Christianity. Denis Otieno, Ebru TV. <laughs>